So guys, I made a video a long time ago about this, about if Marquez fought Lomachenko at 135, what would happen? And I said Lomachenko would outclass Marquez. I, I've gone back and watched some of Marquez's fights and I'm thinking, I might have to rethink this, you know. I, might, I, I thought I have to make another video on this because... I think Marquez was a special fighter. He didn't have the flashy skills of a Lomachenko. He definitely wasn't naturally the more talented fighter out of Lomachenko. But Marquez was an exceptional counterpuncher. And Lomachenko gets hit. And Lomachenko is not a natural 135. And Marquez for me is one of one of the best lightweights. Um, you know, definitely one of the best. You know, I think he's, he's an unbelievable fighter, Marquez. You know, probably doesn't get as much credit. He was a... Granite chin, uh, great right hand. We saw that against Pacquiao. And I was thinking if Linares can put Lomachenko down, if Marquez lands a big right hand on Lomachenko's chin, could he sleep him? Possibly. I think Lomachenko would win a points decision if the fight went 12 rounds, but I do think Marquez could knock him out. Let's not forget Marquez is better than anyone that Lomachenko's fought in his career when you think about it. And Marquez is special. You know, Marquez was a great, great fighter. You know, Lomachenko may have the silky skills, but a right hand with, you know, a right hand could change all of those silky skills for Marquez. Marquez was special. And I actually think that Marquez could win that fight by knockout. I think he'd have to win by knockout because I don't think he'd outpoint Lomachenko, but that's a very, very good fight. Uh, and I, I think Marquez could stop him. I think Marquez could stop Loma. Uh, I think Marquez would be a massive step up to anything that Lomachenko's been in the ring with. Uh, Marquez is a legend. He's a Mexican legend. Um, and he even fought as, as high as welterweight. So, you know, Marquez is would be a monster for Lomachenko to handle. And I think I actually think that, you know, a lot of people would automatically say Lomachenko, but I think Marquez would be would have a great chance of stopping Lomachenko. Marquez had a massive right hand. And not just that, Marquez was the bigger man out of the two. Marquez was a great counter puncher. And Lomachenko could be countered. And Marquez had a granite chin. Uh, ah, that's a hard fight for Lomachenko. When you think about it, when you think about what Marquez did in his career, um, I think I think Marquez could win that fight by knockout. Uh, but Lomachenko's a box of tricks. He'd have to outbox Marquez for twelve rounds, not getting caught with any anything big, because Marquez I think would be the bigger man. Uh, let's not forget this guy put Manny Pacquiao to sleep. So Marquez is no joke. Anyone that beats Manny Pacquiao and gave Manny Pacquiao hell in all four fights is a serious fighter. You know, we may overlook that, but I actually think, I'm rethinking it. I would actually make Marquez the favourite, if I'm honest. If, if, if Lomachenko can somehow manage to go 12 rounds, he could win. But if he doesn't, if he gets caught by Marquez, I think it's all over. Uh, because I think Marquez could sleep him. I'm being serious. I think Marquez was a very good fighter. Like I said, a very good counter puncher. Um... He fought as high as well. He fought as high as welterweight. So again, Marquez, you know, he's bigger, stronger. He was just an overall good fighter, and I think it would be a hard fight for Loma. Uh, it wouldn't be easy, but that's. Uh, but I, I, I do think Loma can win a decision. I think Loma could outbox him. Uh, it's just whether he can stay away from you know Marquez's right hand. Right hand, dangerous. You know, Marquez could. Marquez's right hand was quite dangerous. Quite a dangerous punch. Um, and Lomachenko's a southpaw, and southpaws get hit with straight right hands. So, again, it's, it would be a great fight, but I think I think um, I would lean towards Loma, even though I said uh, Marquez potentially would be a favorite. I just think Loma has the skills, but again, it's one of them. It's one of them which you can't call. You know, Marquez was special, and like I said, I don't think Lomachenko's been in the ring with anyone as good as Marquez. So, when you put that all together. You know, it's a hard one to call. But leave your thoughts. Let me know what you think, guys. And guys, remember to please like, share, subscribe to my channel. I'll see you guys in the next video.